<laughs> yes, the title of this video is no joke. I am 38 and I've never had a Mick rip. Wait a minute. <gasps> Hey everyone, welcome to the Showstopper Shows. I'm the Showstopper. This is Must or Bust. And I'm going to tell you, for the first time in my life, whether or not the McRib is a must or bust for me. So this is not someone who's telling you, hey, it's back, although it is right now. Again, it's a limited time. But this is the first time I've ever tried it. And I got to tell you, it smells really, really good. So I basically read up on it, and, and I'm going to pop it up on your screen too. It's definitely pork and it's dipped in its ribs, it's boneless ribs, and it's dipped in barbecue sauce. And then it's topped with pickles and the onions. As you can see, whoever made this, this particular McRib does not take a whole lot of pride in their work as they just tossed it on and threw it down the line. However, it still looks and smells amazing. I'm sitting here and I've had it for about 10 minutes in my car now and it's dripping down the sides as you can see, the barbecue sauce and it smells really good. So I'm gonna dive in. It looks like, so it's basically like two halves, one side with the onions and the pickles and the other side ooh, does not. All right, so <laughs> let's go ahead and taste this. All right, let's go. Other side with the veggies. All right, so where am I at with this in the first time tasting this, you know, in my lifetime? I'm actually enjoying this McRib sandwich. I'm not a huge fan of the pickles and onions on the McRib. However, the sauce and the consistency of the bread, which I love this bun, and the McRib itself, the rib sandwich, is phenomenal. I'm pleasantly and happily surprised that after all this time, I'm getting something that tastes good. This sauce is sweet and tangy. I like it. It's got great barbecue taste to it. And it's basically like sauce you get in your fridge and pour it over some ribs. And it's it's hot, it's juicy, it's, it's not overcooked. Everything about this sandwich is really, really good. It's messy as all get out. So if you were playing, planning on wearing your white you know, shirt to work today and then you're gonna stop for this for lunch, wear a bib. It was $3.89 or $6.89 for the combo. I went for the combo. I got my Diet Coke and some fries to go with this. But I am pleasantly and happily surprised at this sandwich. So I am going to be rating this a total and 100% bust. No. I'm just messing with you. If this is, if Muscle Party is streaming this on his channel, which I've seen him do, that was for you, buddy. Cause this is a must. Boom, and it is good. I'm tired of even talking here while and holding this because I'm ready to jump back in and taste this. This is so good. People have told me the consistency wasn't good of the meat, that it felt stuck or pressed together. I am pleasantly happy with this. So if you guys like this, if you have not tried this and you're like me and you're in your middle ages now, yeah, sure, and you're like, you know what, I've never had one, let me go get one, let me risk it for the biscuit, as some people say, we're going for it. I am telling you this is pretty good. This is actually really good. So if you guys are one of those people like me and you haven't tried it, get out and try it and then comment below and say, yo, showstopper, you tell me what you think. And I can't wait to hear from you guys. This is so good. I'm ready to jump back into this. It's December the 1st. It's cold here where I am and I'm enjoying it. The Chiefs are 10 and one. It's all good guys. It's all gravy. All right, so hey, if you don't already, subscribe to this channel, hit the notification bell so you get rang every time I post. And, and please give this a like. And thank you so much for all of your support. I decided to speak a little slower today. That way the captions from YouTube can pick me up. So I can't even really set this down. The main reason is that it has, that like you can't set it in the container because it's so messy in there and then the whole thing gets messy and it's just a big messy mess. So I usually will just hold it and continue to eat it until it's gone and then I will be good. But anyway, that's, that's all for me today. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and um, thank you for watching the Showstopper Show. So may the forks be with you. May his presence be with you always and everywhere. 
put a bow on this show because that's a wrap and I'm ready to eat it anyway. <laughs> the show stops here. Never quits, y'all. Man, Merry Christmas. Check out the videos popping up here on my end screen, y'all. Check them out. Thanks. Water.